Hey Geeks, Tim Tibbetts with MajorGeeks.com. Today showing you how to install extensions on the Chromium-based Microsoft Edge from the Google Chrome Web Store. It's only a couple of steps. It's really, really easy to do. And at the time of this video, which is April of 19, the Google Chromium-based Microsoft Edge, which you can download right here, is still new, meaning there's less extensions available for Microsoft Edge as opposed to Google Chrome, which has been out for so long. So if you want to get access to more extensions, here's what you need to do. You're going to find a link right here, and I will link to this page in the YouTube video description to the Chrome Web Store right here. So go ahead and click that and open the Chrome Web Store. Now, I've already been playing around with it, so your message will be different. Yours will look something like this with a link that says Manage Extensions. So you're going to go ahead and click on that. When you click on Manage Extensions, actually, it's going to do this the three dots here just in case you like me don't see it right now or you already closed that window so click those three dots go to extensions but before you do close the Chrome Web Store because you're gonna to need to reload it when you're done so go ahead and kill that off alright so come right down here and you can see allow extensions from other stores get your big bad error message click allow and that's it you can close extensions out and now go back to the Chrome Web Store and like you saw er originally because I played with it you will now see this message and it just tells you what to do so you can close that and you're done with the messages so let's start with uh, let's just pick a random extension I actually use Grammarly uh, that's right that horrible typing and grammar and spelling that you see is actually done with yeah with help <laughs> oh, wasted education add to Chrome so it's kinda odd because you know you're not in Chrome what are you gonna do so you'll notice when you click that though it does say add Grammarly for Chrome to Microsoft Edge you anybody to use Chrome is used to seeing these messages and you click on add extension as you know we just wait a minute for it to install and there you go there's my Grammarly right here pretty easy right works just like Google Chrome you just have to make sure that you enable it here and we'll just repeat that three dots extensions just make sure you enable it right here change your mind you can uncheck it and of course much like Google Chrome this is your extension manager so I can click that icon and it's gone turn it on or off and of course get details and if I want I can remove it here you go piece of cake so Go ahead and check out the new Microsoft Edge. I'm kind of digging it. I'm, kind of, I'm a Chrome user anyway, so I, I don't know that I'll switch. I don't know that it's worth it, but I think uh, any geek ought to give it a shot. So worst case scenario, give it a try. See what you think. And as always, we thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.